Okay, uh, welcome back to my playthrough of Call of Duty 1. I have resolved the issue, but this is being recorded the day after I recorded the last two episodes. But I have managed to resolve the issue. It was just simply the one time that I went and played multiplayer, I had played on a modded server, and those mods were installed and they somehow managed to screw up the sound files. But now we can actually go ahead and hop on into the game, but I would also like to go ahead and mention that when I get around to playing Call of Duty United Offensive, that will be in the exact same playlist as the original Call of Duty, because I see no reason whatsoever to have them in two separate playlists. Granted, that's not important anyway, but I just figured I'd go ahead and mention that. So let's go ahead and hop on in again. And it should be resolved now. I had already tried it real quick, and it was, so... If it crashes on me now, it's probably because I'm recording. So that's done. Clear an area. Clear area of any remaining enemy forces. Okay. Do if I don't get shot in the face though. Okay, I knew it was now oh, there it is. Um assemble the enforcement. Let's go and grab all these health kits, because why not? Tank. Uh, the physics for the tank going over the wall didn't exactly look right. But, uh, oh well, so yes, there we go, we have finished that mission, finally. Every man's life ends the same way. It is only the details of how he lived and how he died that distinguishes one man from another. Ernest Hemingway, I'm pretty sure I read that one before, but it's been a while, so I figured why not go ahead and read it again. Junior Sergeant Voronin or Voronin. I'm probably mispronouncing that, but oh well. I am not really good at pronouncing Russian anyway, so it's to be expected. I've read the reports of your actions with the 13th Guards Division at Stalingrad and Kursk. You should consider yourself very lucky to have made it this far. Of the more than 10,000 troops who fought in your division at Stalingrad, you were among some 260 survivors. In response to my recent request for experienced troop replacements, you have been transferred to assist the units under my command. A soldier with a good record like yours will do us some good. In the next few days, we will advance through Warsaw, forcing the Germans to retreat even further. I am sending troops ahead of the offensive into the manufacturing districts, manufacturing districts to clear out factories and rail yards being used by the Germans to repair their tanks. As you will be responsible for leading one of the squads into the area, you are hereby promoted to full sergeant, Major P.K. Grishin. Grishin, 150, 50th Rifle Division, 3rd Shock Army. Warsaw, Poland, January 17, 1945. This is an interesting way to just go and like throw us into the mission. I need to actually one second, let me try to fix my audio on my end. It's off center. Are you sure we'd have French champagne in um, Germany? I mean, I'm sure you can buy it, sure, but really?
You're all looking the same damn direction. Don't do that. You're all idiots for looking the exact same freaking direction. Who the hell does that? Just go ahead and make sure area is clear. I don't know why they even bother giving me a pistol. Why is it a Luger? It's supposed to be Russian, not German. Why the hell am I carrying Lugers? Or a Luger, not Lugers. Okay, I could just, oh yeah, okay. They've got a lot of these medkits lying about. Am I... Is like supposed to take a shit ton of damage or something? We're doing pretty good here. Let's save. Here, real quick. Saving quite often. Oh god, not expecting that one. I did not know there was going to be a guy right there. Okay, it's just kind of odd that these guys are all standing. Pretty much dead. It's not exactly fun. Take our time. What? 
Okay, no idea what got me there. You guys keep getting me when I can't really see them well enough to be able to actually hit them. Who the hell throws a grenade at that distance, you retard? Yeah, I wasn't the brightest of the bunch. Or wasn't the brightest light bulb in the uh, box. In this case, I, guess. I mean, I can understand the enemy throwing one right there. That one would have been pretty good if I wasn't able to actually get away in time. Whoops! Don't. Damn it, guys! <laughs> How are they all doing in these locations? Okay, short mission, or at least short portion of a mission. <laughs> Courage is fear holding on a minute longer. Well, no, yeah, because how old this game is technically that is one mission, but it's so short that I don't consider it much more. That distance. Get down, grenade. It's out. They don't know we're here. Would they stop if they did know? Hard to say. Come 
Oh god damn Why does it seem like one of those guys had a pistol? So I'm gonna have to deal with that tank on myself probably in the end. Shit, that thing's alive? I wasn't paying any attention because it didn't shoot at me before. No, give me... Stay low. Give me the freaking Rosen thing. That's what happens when we make me fight something that acts as though it doesn't exist. Or else it's dead. see anything in there. He shot. Did he kill it? Because if AI killed something, holy... Something's wrong if the AI kills something. Okay. Oh, didn't know there was a 
It's not even trying to look like it wants to. Artillery is still going on, so you can't really say we got to get out of here before the artillery starts again, because it's still going on, from what I can tell. History will be kind to me, for I intend to write it. Okay. <clears throat> We're almost upon the Otter River, or... Er, Odor, odor, I think it's odor, I don't know why. Even though it's not actually spelt like the animal, but whatever. Uh, from there, it is less than 70 kilometers to the lair of the fascist beast. Some of our tank crews are decorated veterans of the Battle of Kursk. They will lead this drive to the otter. However, there are still severe shortages of trained tank crews. The expanded design of our new T-3485 tank accommodates five crew members, but many of the crews under my command have as few as three crewmen. To be fully effective, these crews must have a driver, mechanic, a whole machine gunner, a main gunner, a loader, and a commander. And the driver and mechanic are the same guy. I just didn't bother reading it as if they're the same. I have been authorized to enlist soldiers at will from the infantry to fill out the Incomplete crews, given your combat record, you will be the commander slash spotter of a, or for a less experienced, but technically competent tank crew. When the next batch of fully trained replacements reaches the front, you will be returned to your former unit. Report to the tank bearing tactical number 1126. I think that's 1126, or is it a 7? I think it's a 1, though. Looks like a 1. By 0900 hours. Colonel G. V. Andropov. Second Guards Tank Army. Approaching the oh, Use movement keys to turn the tank. Okay, let's actually save. Okay. So space allows me to t turn with my entire tank when I turn the gun. Which I'll probably be using a bit, but not often. But thanks. Wait, we're going this way? We're not going to cross the stream? I mean, I'm fine with that, but... Yeah, sure there's not tanks over there? Because they can't look like it. Maybe they're just wreckages. Or they could also be friendly tanks, one of the two. No, they're tank wreckages, it looks like. Or armored personnel carriers. Just... General destroyed vehicles. Okay, we'll automatically fire at troops in front of them. Yeah, 
I need to turn my tank, but I can't. Use a friendly as a uh, as cover. Don't let up, comrades! Oh, that one didn't. Go Hurry up, get it. moving! Push you. Don't let any survive. Franz? His name is Franz? Where's Hans? Because they need to be here to pump you up. I'm, I'm sorry, that's just what came to my mind. So how do you like that, Franz? Beat up. Can our mechanic like patch us up or something on his own? Hansa. Okay, this tree didn't collapse when the teammate went through it. It's actually kind of odd. Oh shit! Far too beat up for one thing, then. Sadly, teammate, um, his tank wasn't providing any sort of cover. I'll just, I'll sit in the rear. How about that? Probably help if I actually turn my tank instead of just my gun. Good job, guys. Apparently I'm talking to the AI, so it doesn't really matter. But nonetheless, great job, guys. Keep them coming. Don't let up, 